new outboard, things got so much power and so such quick throttle response, it, it's kind of scary. It also feels like it's set up backwards from the other engine, but I doubt that's the case. That's the long lines. One night in Keone. Love this place. Too bad we can't stay a couple days. We're long lined in over here. We just got the new engine on the dinghy. And the dinghy is remaining inflated. And now we're getting a cold beer. What could be better? jewelry store we've ever seen in Greece. And this bracelet, I just love it. Oh, it's beautiful. It's really presented right. I'm going later. This is the town key where we spent so much time last mm -hmm. year. It's free to stay here. Um, there's not even any, any request that you eat at a mm -hmm. particular taverna or anything. Just, uh, but you gotta get here early in the morning. You can't wait. You don't get here by, say, 11 o'clock in the morning. You probably won't get a spot. It's okay. Hello. Hello. How's your How's your uh, week you going? Very good. Thank you. Excellent. Where are you from? standing by on 14. Around suspension bridge. 
We'll be heading into the uh, Gulf of Corinth once we're on the other side here, I believe. We have the radio in and we check our mast height, make sure we're going through the right opening. Trezonia? People at the Tavernas. Yeah. Uh, we forgot to turn the cameras on when we were docking here at Trezona. It's a little, little frustrated by that, but it really wasn't anything exciting. We just kind of laid up against this concrete um, pier. The the problem is that they, they started to build this marina and they, they laid the concrete blocks in the chains for permanent moorings and then never set them, which means that if you drop your anchor out there, you're likely to get it caught on something and you'd need to dive or get it, hire a diver to, to untangle it. So that's why most of the boats are, are laid up. There's also a wreck, supposedly, in here someplace. I don't know how big it is, probably just like a small you know fishing boat or something like that. But these boats over here are are do have um, laid moorings. I don't know if they've set them themselves or if the marina's kind of getting back together. I do see a lot of sand. I see a ton of building materials over here on the other side uh, that make it look like uh, they, they might be doing something. Uh, I don't know. Uh, lots of fishing boats. There's a little tiny harbor on the other side. So we're going to walk over there and see um, what's uh, What's going on here? So Wendy used used the spare tent poles um, from the uh, sunshade to make this just hand based this little uh, mosquito screen. And it's got one down at the bottom for weight, and it and she kind of hooks it together with uh, with clothespins pins to keep them stuck in. in. Uh, like so, reverse spring for that, and very cool. Simple, 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 effective, not perfect, but it'll do. It'll do, pig. Say again, simple and effective? It's simple and effective, baby. Okay. It'll do. Excellent. Yeah, you know, it looks to me like they're rebuilding it. It looks like they're, they're getting it together to look at all these newly planted trees and a new, new road. They're running um, water. So it looks like they've got water here. I wonder if it's on. Probably not. Oh no. It's on. What do you know? Sound like a pro. Yamas. Oh, 
Arizona was absolutely beautiful. Very, very happy with uh, with it. It's just the, it's just the most amazing place. It's um, I honestly have never seen anything like it before. It's the entire town is being redone all at once, including the probably the marina eventually. Uh, but there's not a a home in the, uh, along the harbor that's not been recently painted. Uh, they all have new roofs. There's a ton of building materials on the dock. Uh, it's just it's it's just really something to see. We're wondering if there's not like one guy who bought it all, um, like the whole island or something, and just decided to make a you know a, a made from scratch, uh, um, you, you know, uh, t t you know destination town. Um, it's, it is in a pretty decent location. It's on the way through the Corinth Canal, so you need a stop, a layover spot, and this is a good one. I'm very, very happy with it.